And the destruction continued in Gaza today, with the UN saying the humanitarian crisis there is worsening ahead of an expected Israeli ground invasion. Over a million Palestinians have fled their homes in the past day or so, with the death toll approaching 3,000. Many are headed to the border with Egypt, where has remained closed off, keeping aid and supplies out as well. Nearly 600 Americans are part of the group trapped there, and hospitals are struggling to keep up as they worry about running out of fuel soon. And there were more critically ill patients needing to go to the ORs. These wounds are getting infected. And today, the Israeli military said there are about 200 people being held captive in Gaza. Hamas said they want thousands of people freed in exchange for their hostages. President Biden says he plans to visit the Middle East this week to meet with several nations' leaders.